and uh, on my trip of exploration, every evening by my campfire, I'd pull out my book and record what had happened that day. Now it was not only beneficial on my next trip into Kentucky, think about it. It's the only way you can know what happened. I kept my trip journal and after I died it was passed on to family members. Once part of it was misplaced for a few years and if it had not been found then those segments would have been lost from available historical knowledge forever. Probably what I should have done is this, make another copy for a more durable and secure record. We've been on a long journey, so let's review where we have been and where we can go from here. Our educational journey has been about Mars 2030, and we have looked at questions concerning uh, the infrastructure, exploration, and societal structure. And hopefully we found some answers, but of course there are still some unknowns. And uh, after we reach Mars, will we find what we anticipated? And of course we'll always have to face those challenges of the unexpected. Also remember that communication is complex and has verbal, vocal, and visual aspects to it. You will need to have good communication wherever you go whatever you do. And remember that multitasking is an essential skill to develop, whether you're here on Earth or on Mars. And it's important to have a balance in life. So include time for wholesome leisure activities to refresh your body, mind, and spirit. To conclude, I trust that you made the connection between my journey of exploration, coal camps, and future space colonies. Just like people came after me to settle Kentucky, so some of you may be inspired to follow the Mars rovers. So journey, spirit, and opportunity. And even if that is not your goal, realize that the things that you have learned here will help you achieve whatever your particular dream is. Remember back to the very beginning of this program when we watched how eons ago, early in the history of our universe, an asteroid was formed from an explosion. In the same way, your ideas, formed about whatever your dreams are, can head out alongside other people's dreams, traveling on their own paths to their own destinations. Your particular ideas and dreams may take you on a far-reaching course until after your several years educational journey, you find yourself out of college and at the beginning of your chosen career, whether here on Earth or elsewhere in the solar system. Be aware that on your trip there will be obstacles to overcome and things to avoid. Don't give up. You may encounter times of peer pressure pulling you to do drugs or other things that are bad for your physical and emotional health, but your dreams can help you break free from that pull and continue on a path of your choosing feeling the stronger urge to continue toward your destiny. Continue like that long time ago asteroid that headed toward the landmass now known as North America and the specific target that is now known as Middlesbrough, Kentucky. So hit your dreams to a star and let it guide you until your education, your responsibility, your perseverance, your desire to do honestly well in life, all propel you to your goals. And like Middlesbrough, Kentucky, was built in the impact crater. So let your life have impact on others and let them expand and build on what you do. Well, I've enjoyed our visit. Now it's time for me to say farewell. Bon voyage. See you later.